Hello, my YouTube friends. How are you doing? So, today we are watching the review clips of some gorgeous bikinis. I am sure you will definitely like them. As always, we came up with 9 sets in our video and I will select the best bikini for you, which depends on material, used, color, comfort, fit and finish. And as you know that I made this channel to help you in selecting the best bikini or lingerie for you or for your partner. And if you are new here, then subscribe my channel and turn on all notifications to get the latest videos every day. Thanks. Keep watching the videos and please don't forget to press the like button. I love this one also. My armpits are super red because I waxed them yesterday, so that's fun. But yes, this one is a new Oh my god! Wow! If I was a color in this universe that we live in, this would be it! This might be my favorite color of all time. I mean, this coral color is just out of this world. Stunning, stunning, stunning! Okay, let's talk about the fit. I am in a medium top and a medium bottom and I will be in a medium throughout the rest of this haul and try on. I love the high-waisted bottoms. They have lots of tummy control and you'll see the tummy control throughout all of the high-waisted bottoms again throughout this entire haul and try on. The cut of this bottom is just so good. It fits me everywhere like a glove and we are wedgie proof. I've been walking around in these for a little bit and they're not giving me a wedgie. Whew. The elastic feels great. It is not too tight and it is not too loose. So they are staying just right in place where they should be. Let's move on to the top. Let's just say that the top feels very secure. It's almost feeling as if it's like a sports bra with the amount of compression that it's giving me. I wouldn't say that it's too small because I feel like if I went up to the large, it might be too big. I don't really know, but I mean, as you guys can see right here, my chest is sort of coming out the top of it just a little bit. I'm gonna just try to readjust to see if it will be any better. I mean, it doesn't look bad on and it doesn't feel too tight, but I know that it is a little bit feeling like, if you know what I mean. With that being said, you guys can actually order a different size top than a different size bottom, which makes this website like, a complete gem because oftentimes when you are buying bathing suits you have to buy the same size bottom and the same size top you don't have to do this with popville you can actually buy separates which is just amazing there are removable cups in the top as you guys know if you've been here a while I actually like to keep them in because it gives me a little bit more of a security feeling you don't have to see my nipples and it gives me a little bit of shape and a little bit extra sort of coverage there is a great sort of closure in the back here. The straps are adjustable, which is great. And again, if we could just talk about the color for one more second. I mean, if this is not pure happiness in a swimsuit, I don't know what is. Pasamos a este bikini de aquí que eh, la verdad parece un danonino por los colores básicamente, pero me encanta. La verdad es que me encanta. La tela es prácticamente igual al blanco que os lo acabo de enseñar. Es una tela súper agradable, realmente a mí me encanta este tipo de tela. Y me he dado cuenta que en la página de Zaful habían bastantes bikinis bicolor. Y uno de ellos que me cogí, creo que tengo otro bicolor, es este que es verde pistacho clarito y eh, rosa clarito. La parte de arriba ya es que me enamora solamente de verla. Si lo miras así, parece un mandó con una tira gruesa en el lado derecho y luego tiene otra tira pero más finita que también pasa por la parte del pecho y va hacia el mismo lado que la tira gruesa. Tiene como una especie de arito en la parte central, que esto la verdad es rígido, pero cuando me lo he probado no me molestaba para nada. Y este no tiene ajuste tampoco en la parte de detrás. Se estira, entonces si dependiendo de cómo tengáis la espalda, si la tenéis un poquito más ancha, pues no pasará nada, si no, pues quizá os queda como más holgado. Y la parte de la balanita es que me encanta, ya sabéis que eh, a mí las partes así en forma de V me fascinan. La parte de delante sí que se divide en rosa y verde y no tiene ajustes para nada 
tal cual, pero queda perfecta, a mí no me aprieta para nada. Y la parte del culete es brasileña y rosita entera. Es que este me parece una fantasía. Vamos a pasar con mmm, mi desilusión, vamos a llamarlo así, porque es el único que me va más pequeño de todo. Uh, uh. If you guys hear clinking around, just my hermit crab, like, having a moment. Do you want to see? Okay. Just having a moment. It's fine. So this is the top. This one is in a size small, but it looks pretty big. But originally I, I made that reaction because the padding is, like, very visible, I guess, from the inside. I don't know. It's not so bad from the front, but I can just take that out. But this is cute. It does look a little bit big. Again, this one's really boobalicious. But we'll give it a shot. The back has this like metal clasp. Clasp. So normally this is like, if it fits you, it fits you. If it doesn't, it doesn't. So, and then these are the bottoms. Very, very high waisted again. But like I said, that's what I was going for this year because of the belly. So we're just gonna give it a shot. But they are cute. I love the pink color. Alrighty guys, so here is the pink one. This one makes me feel like I'm in the 90s or something just because of the style of it. But I got this one in a medium and I remember saying I thought it was going to be too big, but it actually fits me really well. The top is, I wouldn't even say big because it does have the adjustable strap so I can make it a little bit tighter, which I need to. But other than that, again, this top part a little bit thicker and smaller than the lower part. So it just pulls everything in so if you guys are looking for something like <laughs> i hate that if you guys are looking for something like this style just search high-waisted bikinis because honestly the way that they are just made even though this is like a six dollar bikini i don't know how much it is it just is amazing it's amazing let me first start out by saying that I'm not sure if this is navy blue or black, but either way, it is gorgeous. I love the juxtaposition of the dark base of the bathing suit with the floral bright colored pattern. I think it is just so beautiful together. I also really, really, really love this detailing around the seam of the bottom and the top. I think that it just adds another layer of interest to the suit and it makes it so stylish. I love the fact that this is sort of like looking like a halter triangle top, but it actually is just two regular straps that are adjustable. They do have removable pads. I love the fact that this is just so soft extremely stretchy and none of the bathing suits that I've tried on today are see-through so the quality of the fabric is pretty much top-notch the bottoms fit me really well I did pull up the sides just ever so slightly but it actually is a very very good high-waisted fitting bottom the bottoms are wedgie proof yay for that I love the fact that this top has adjustable straps because I did need to give myself a little bit more lift. I am in a medium top and a medium bottom. This fits really well. And I love that it's something a little bit different, something that I'm not usually sort of attracted to because it is dark. I love my bright colors. I steer away from blacks pretty much all the time. But when I saw this floral pattern in conjunction with the dark base of the bathing suit, it sold me immediately. Who are you? Y es este de aquí Me da una pena horrible porque me parece precioso La parte de arriba sí que tiene ya un enganche para poder enganchártelo Pero tampoco tiene regulador, únicamente en los tirantes La parte del pecho tiene un arito, los otros no tenían aro Y te deja como el pecho más recogido, tiene un volantito también en la parte del pecho Y a mí me va un poco pequeño. Podría pasar y podría ir con él, pero me siento un poco como que si me agacho o cualquier cosa se me puede salir algo. Pero la verdad es que me gusta muchísimo. Es, tiene un color naranjita tirando un poquito a coral y esto resalta el moreno, que es que no lo sabéis. Y la parte de debajo también eh, tiene forma de triángulo, no tan pronunciado como los otros dos que os acabo de enseñar. La parte de los lados tiene una tira más finita que el bikini anterior y tiene como una arandela en cada lado, pero no tiene ajuste, es tal cual. Este bikini sí que tiene una tela de bañador normal de toda la vida y yo creo que esta tela se seca antes que las otras, mi opinión. 
The next one. Oh, I remember this one. So this looks like a basic black bikini, but it has this little peekaboo moment right here in the front, which I think is so flattering. Again, I got this in a size small, so hopefully it'll fit the girls, but it looks like they will. But I love that. I mean, it's simple, but it's also like a small little detail is so flattering. Also, the material on this one feels really good. Ooh, and these are the bottoms. I actually, I actually like these. I feel like these cover up more than the other ones did. But these are so comfy and thin. It's a little bit ripped. I like this one. I like this one. It's a cute little number. All right, guys. So I love this one. The bottoms are pretty like full coverage, which I like because the top is a little bit more scandalous, but um, I don't know how much I can show on YouTube, but it makes the girls look good. It's comfy, it holds me in. I love this one. Also the material is so, so soft and like not thin, like you're gonna see through it, but thin, like super comfortable and you're not gonna be hot in it. So this one is a definite yes. We have officially made it to the last swimsuit from my Popville swimsuit haul and try on for us curvy girls. This last suit is a green number that I feel like I wouldn't normally have been gravitated towards because it just seems a little bit plain. However, I feel like we all need just a plain classic no bells and whistles swimsuit and I think that this is it. These high-waisted bottoms fit really well and it seems like all of the bathing suits that I tried on today are completely wedgie proof, which I love. The swimsuit does have some texture to it, so it's not completely plain. It has this sort of like geometric sort of striped pattern, this sort of like almost basket weave pattern that I really like. So it gives it a little bit of style, but it's not overbearing and it's not over the top. I wanted to just quickly point out on the top that I feel like I I could have maybe even done a size small. I'm in a size medium. Their straps are not adjustable and I'm almost feeling as if like I could maybe, you know, pull it up a tiny bit because it feels like there's a little bit of extra fabric in this sort of top place right here. So I'm I'm not really sure what's causing that. Maybe it's that I'm not filling out the triangle cups uh, the way that I should. Again, for reference, I'm a size 34D in bra, but I feel like if I had just been able to sort of tighten up the straps, it might have actually fit a tiny bit better. So just keep that in mind. This may be a bathing suit top where you do go down a size because it does have some extra fabric at the top. But other than that, I love it. I love the fact that there are no closures. I do love that. I love that there's like no things to worry about. You just sort of throw on this top like it was a bralette and you go. Ya que había empezado a hablar de bikinis bicolor, voy a continuar por el otro que tengo y ya sabéis que el color rosa es de mis favoritos, sobre todo para vestir y nada, pues me cogí un bikini bicolor rosa. Me parece precioso. Una parte es rosa clarito pastel y la otra fucsia. Tiene en la parte del top un arito también en la parte de central del pecho. Los tirantes son regulables y aquí tiene un enganche en la parte de la espalda pero no se puede regular. Eh, la copa es en forma de triángulo, yo también obviamente le he quitado el relleno y no tiene arito. Este bikini la verdad me queda bastante ajustado, no siento que me vaya, vaya a levantar los brazos y se me vaya a ver mmm, el pecho y voy muy a gusto con él. Y la parte de abajo de la braguita no tiene ningún tipo de ajuste, es tal cual una braguita en forma de triángulo en color fucsia entero <risa> es que me encanta, me encanta este color sobre todo en bikini, me parece precioso, y en el caso de esta tela es como si fuera de canalé algo así parecido pero se nota que es tela de bikini so, love this. so the winner of today's try and haul is this it has a smart look with a smooth material and fit it is the best and beautiful among all the bikinis. Thanks, keep watching the videos and please don't forget to press the like button.